So where do those who are actively working in AI see it heading? The future is already here. With models like GPT-4, you can go and talk to this piece of machinery and have it respond at beyond Einstein levels across a range of different fields. Suddenly, neural nets have become better than most people at most of the cognitive tasks we're giving it to the point where it's like, passing bar exams and passing medical exams. If we look at the progress of humanity for the last few hundred years, we've had the agricultural or agrarian revolution, the industrial revolution, the information revolution with the internet, they're all gonna be just small blips on the chart. Right now we're in this almost vertical leap or rocket ship that seems to have no end in sight. I can't predict what that looks like, but right now we're in the middle of something extraordinary and it's going to make everything else just look like a flat line as we head up to the stars. I am really excited about what the world that my daughter is going to grow up into might look like. She may be able to flourish as a human being in a way that no one's ever been able to before, but some part of me is really also uncomfortable. We don't know where this is going and where it's going may not be great. Whether you see AI as a savior or as the enemy, one thing is clear. AI is here to stay and we need to find a way to work with it. Did you see the memo about this? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I have the memo right here. I just... Super intelligence is unfolding at lightning pace. Read my industry-grade analysis of AI that matters as it happens in plain English, the memo. Yeah. Did you get that memo? Yeah, I got the memo. Get the inside look as AI models are embodied into humanoids, AI's IQ increases to nearly perfect, and bleeding edge use cases expand to the entire world. Yeah, didn't you get that memo? Editions are sent to subscribers at Fortune 500s, major governments, and people like you. Lifearchitect.ai slash memo. I have the memo.